While in Israel, President Biden pledged renewed financial support for the nation's defenses. Abby Larico from Verify joins us to take a look at what that looks like and how it compares to previous support of the country. I'm going to ask the United States Congress for unprecedented support package for Israel's defense. Social media is full of posts asserting various dollar amounts. So how much money does the United States typically send to Israel? We turn to several sources here to verify billions. Israel is the largest cumulative recipient of U.S. foreign assistance since World War II, according to this Congressional Research Service report. The United States sends more than $3 billion of support to Israeli defense forces each year as part of a series of agreements dating back decades. Last year, the American-Israel Public Affairs Committee touted congressional action securing more than $4.8 billion total for Israel, which included, quote, $1 billion in additional funding for Israel's Iron Dome missile defense system. That's part of a total Israeli military budget of more than $23 billion last year, according to Stockholm International Peace Research Institute data. The White House also announced an additional $100 million in humanitarian funding to the other side of the Israel border, in Gaza. Through working with the UN and NGOs, the White House said, quote, this funding will help support over a million displaced and conflict-affected people with clean water, food, hygiene support, medical care, and other essential needs. However, this is receiving criticism from several different angles, from those worried that that money could too easily wind up in the hands of Hamas terrorists. Also from others who say with this level of humanitarian need we're seeing in Gaza, that amount of money won't go nearly far enough. With your Verify, I'm Abby Larico.